Hi everyone, me again in lovely Smyrna, Georgia. My lovely wife, Susan, is uh, on an airplane coming back from San Diego. She had to work today, so I got all my chores done finally. It was a long, long day for me, but uh, and as you can see, here it is, it's uh, nightfall. Uh, the sky is still a little bit bright. I'm sure the camera, I know the camera really captures the light really well, so it'll probably look like daylight for you, but it's getting dark. I don't have my sunglasses on. I got my regular glasses so that I can legally drive. But um, I thought we'd come out here. I haven't been to the cover bridge in a while. And we don't usually come down here with the spider because of the... Uh, uh, there are just two, ra two runners going through the bridge and Susan's rear tire runs on the cross beams. And it's where all the trash collects. You know, anything that falls off a car or anything like that. You know, would do would uh, end up in there, and she'll run over with a rear tire. So we don't often come down here, but uh, uh, we'll come down here this time since it's just me trying out something new. Uh, if I'd had any sense, I would have taken some pictures of it. Maybe I did. I'll look back in my phone or my camera and see if I did. But I've got a new headlight, uh, just the bulb. Now, for some reason, about uh, about a year ago, I started blowing headlights. Um, I would blow the low beam out and I wouldn't realize that it wasn't burning unless Susan would look in her mirror and say, hey, your, your low beam's out. And I'd flip it over to high beam so that I could keep riding, but uh, uh, eventually the high beam would burn out. And I have put heavy duty bulbs in, I've put, uh, you know, every kind of special bulb, I've even put cheap bulbs in it just to see if it made a difference. And they all last about a week and then the low beam's out again. And I don't know whether it's the vibration or whether I've got a a surge, an electrical surge or something like that, but uh, I got tired of it and I finally said, you know, to heck with this, I'm not going to keep replacing these damn bulbs. And so uh, uh, I ordered one of these. And uh, it's one of these really fancy LEDs. It comes with its own fan to keep it cool. And uh, when you put it in, you have to, you can't put the little rubber seal in with the bulb uh, like you normally would because uh, you need to get all the air you can in there and uh, to keep it cool. But um, I, uh, uh, I've got it in here and I haven't really ridden it much at night. I just wanted to see kind of the brightness level. And I don't know whether you can see anything right here. Got all these cars coming at us, but it is going to get darker. But uh, so far, it looks like it's doing a really good job of brightness. This is low on low beam. I'm not going to flip it on high because I've got too many people coming at me. But uh, I'm going to scoot through the bridge here, see what it looks like uh, lighting that up on low. And uh, then we'll turn and go down one little road here I've got here. But uh, so far, it's worked really well for me. I've uh, gone on sev um, several multi-100 multi mile trips with it so far. And uh, knock on wood, it's working just absolutely perfectly. The downside is expensive. I want to say it was $56, but I'll have to look back in the records and see. If it's different than that, I'll post something on it. But um, uh, so far, so good. If it'll last, I'll be very happy with it because I know I've spent at least that much on H4 uh, halogen bulbs, which is what uh, actually fit in my car as well. But uh, for some reason, they just will not live here in the. Uh, See that center section? That's where the rear tire ends up all the time. But, uh, you know, if it'll stay alive, it'll be well worth the money. Alrighty, well, here we are. This is one of our one of the little roads I really, really like. I'm going to flip it over to high, see if it makes any difference uh, for the filming. I don't know, it still might be too bright. There you go. That's pretty, de pretty decent. That's doing a real good job of lighting up everything. Um, so, uh... I can be happy with the light quality as well as longevity so far. Now being an LED is supposed to last for several thousand hours. Uh, I'll see if I can find some specs on it and post on there for you, as long as, as well as some pictures. But so far I recommend it. Uh, I don't know if anybody, I don't know if anybody's been having the same problem I have. It may, maybe it was just me. Maybe it's something on this old girl here I'm riding, this old V-Star. But uh, uh, hopefully uh, this is going to do the trick. And, you know, we'll see what happens. And uh, I'll do a little video. Uh, I'm going to cut it off here in just a sec. I'll do a little video. It's going to get a little bit darker here, hopefully on the way back through the bridge. And uh, I'll uh, 
I'll come on back in and see what we can get a little better look at it. Maybe I can do a high beam through the bridge. That'd be kind of clever, kind of neat. We'll see. We'll have to see what the uh, traffic's looking like. All righty. Well, we'll be back. Okay. Bit. It's a little darker now. I'm kind of in the trees here, and the, and the sky is getting a little bit darker, but it's still not completely black yet. But uh, I'm afraid that's about as dark as it's going to be to give this headlight a shot and see how, how it's doing. On low, it seems to do real well. It, it lights up the road in front of me real good. Gives me a little bit on either side. On high, it, it brightens up a little more on either side as well. But I'm hoping I can get through the bridge here after this car and we'll, we'll put her on high beam and see how she does inside the darkness of the bridge. All right, here we go. See how it goes? Yeah, how you like that? Boy, it sure looks good to me. Hope it looks good on the camera. Alrighty, and I just blinded that guy big time. It's all right. Okay, well, uh, I highly recommend this light so far. Uh, I'll let you know if it uh, if it craps out on me too soon. I'll let you know uh, in a, another video, or I'll make a note on this one. But uh, right now, so far, everything is good. Okay, I have to wait on that car. This guy's going to stop for me. That's nice. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's call it a night. Uh, I'm going to head on back to the house. Hope everybody's having a great day. Take care.